Hi folks and welcome to part two of my choosing a banjo ukulele and this isn't very long. This is a Keech Model B banjo ukulele. This was sold on eBay, was described as in very nice condition, needs tidying up and got a nice tone. But actually there's two things majorly wrong with this and it applies to lots of banjo ukes on eBay and I want to sort of help you to, to spot these. The first is these have adjustable friction tuners, this model. They're all there, they look quite nice, until you try and tighten them up. When you tighten them up you find as soon as you, you tighten them up they slide back again. It won't hold the tuning. When you go to adjust them the little slot in the screw is so wide because it's so old you can't you can't screw them with this it just slips out so number one when you're checking out something on eBay obviously you make sure it has the obvious things but ask if the tuners when they turn do they hold the tuning do they turn around smoothly and more importantly can you tighten up the screws easily that's the first thing now the second thing is the action that is the height of the strings above the fingerboard. Now, this has got a half inch bridge, which is just about right. But look at that action, look how high that is. That's absolutely ridiculous. It's getting on for half an inch. And you see that, that makes this virtually unplayable. And if you did manage to play a few chords, it would be totally out of tune. Now, the only way uh, the action is corrected is by the angle of this neck against the drum. It has to come more of an angle down like that. Now some people say, well can't you just lower the bridge? Well this is what happens if you lower the bridge when the action is that high. I'll put a lower bridge and the strings don't even rest on it properly because it's so low. So it just slides around and you can't put it in a notch, it just slips out. So the only way the action can be corrected is to do it properly and that means this has to be completely dismantled and the angle of this neck adjusted so it comes up down like that a bit. I'm exaggerating. It doesn't matter if the angle is too acute because you can all, always put a higher bridge but you can't put a lower bridge as what I've just said. And the other things with Keats is to adjust the action you sometimes have to lower this whole drum. Do you see how it's in there like that. In fact this is this drum is in all skew if you see this bit's low and this bit's high. So remember when buying a banjo uke ask the person selling it if the tuners work and if they tighten up okay and secondly ask what the height is of the string above the fingerboard and, and ask for a picture and also ask what the height of the bridge is. If the bridge is half inch or more and the action's okay, then that's cool. But if they say the bridge is much lower than half inch, they've done that bodge of, of trying to lower the action by cutting down the bridge. If you have any questions or any queries, I'm a nice bloke, so just email me at jasperhappyhotcom. No, jasperhappy at hotmail.com. That's jasperhappy at hotmail.com. And I hope you have better luck than this. Thank you.